Car fire causes damage to two Rockford homes overnight. Rockford firefighters responded to the 1800 block of Hoolan Street around 1.30 this morning to find a fully involved vehicle fire. Fire officials say flames extended to a neighboring house. However, everyone inside was able to get out safely. It took crews about 22 minutes to put that blaze out. The fire caused about $35,000 of damage to two homes. And Rockford Fire, the Rockford Fire Department wants to help prevent more house fires in our area. And that's why today, firefighters teamed up with the American Red Cross to install free smoke detectors and fire alarms in 130 Rockford homes. Governor-elect J.B. Pritzker also dropped by to help with that effort today. It's part of his day of service ahead of Inauguration Week. The governor-elect will take the oath of office on Monday, and we're going to have full live coverage of the inauguration online and on air on 13 WREX, so make sure to join us for that. The Rockford Fire Department is also looking to recruit some new firefighters. Rockford Fire, along with the City of Rockford and Rockford Police, are hosting job fairs each Wednesday for the rest of the month. Anyone interested in learning more about employment opportunities can attend one of those job fairs listed on your screen. Each one goes from 1 o'clock to 7 o'clock at night at different locations around Rockford. You can learn more about each event and the application periods for each department by visiting us online at WREX.com. Flag raising ceremony helps honor our local veterans and service members today. Camping World of Rockford opened its doors last year in Roscoe. However, today was the first time it raised its American flag outside the store. The flag raising ceremony became a tradition for the company back in 2014 to show appreciation for our nation's vets and active military. It is important to us as a company uh, to honor our veterans uh, both here and fallen. Um, so it's important for us to.